Welcome back, peoples. I just want to go ahead and make this quick video. Just want to say I hope everyone had a Merry Christmas. And I hope they all y'all had really awesome items received to y'all and stuff like that. For me, I got a couple of cool things. I mean, not a lot because I'm an adult, so my kid days of Christmas is over. But regardless, I did get a couple of things that I want to show y'all. And I ended up going out buying a Christmas gift for myself. Even though I've been doing that kind of like oh, the whole month of December, but regardless, this is a special day, and I just want to show you the stuff I have. So, Christmas already came, and I got a few things from my family, and, you know, it's real simple because, like, you never know what to get a family member or a friend because it's kind of hard. Do they want clothes? Do they want video games? You know, whatever. For me, it's simple because a lot of people know I into electronics, games, and stuff, so they say, you know what? We, Ryan, we don't know what game you want, so let's just make it simple. Here's a gift card. So my family gave me a gift card from GameStop. Get whatever I want, and it's simple, so pretty cool gift card. Besides that, they said, you like movies? Well, here you go. Here's a Cinemark gift card right here. So I could go to the movie theater and watch any movie I want uh, a few times if I want to. So right now, Star Wars is coming out, so... Rogue One came out, so I'm going to go check that out. And another cool thing, um, I don't know if any of y'all are interested in it, but One Piece, the newest One Piece, uh, Gold, Film Gold, that's coming out January 11th to my theater. So I was really psyched about that because usually, like with Dragon Ball Z or, you know, Naruto, they'll have a special U.S. opening of their movies and theaters, but they were never close to where I'm at, so I could never go, but One Piece Film Gold is actually going to show up in my theater, so I'm probably going to use that to check that out, so I'm really hype about that, so that's pretty cool. Uh, besides that, I also got a few things, so I also went to a pawn shop, so I got these two games from a pawn shop, and that's Dragon Ball Z Tenkaichi 2, and Dragon Ball Z Battle of Z. So these are some awesome finds. I uh, got these for $5 each. The boxes are a little dirty, as you can tell. They're a little, they're actually pretty dirty, so I'm going to try to clean them to get the grime off. If I can't, I could always just trade them with some lesser lesser light uh, boxes so I could at least have my Dragon Ball Z boxes looking good. And I do love Dragon Ball Z, so yeah, awesome to get those. And like I said, with the gift card, I went to GameStop. I actually got a game with that gift card, and that's Duke Nukem 3D, the 20th Anniversary World Tour. So this is an old game. Uh, this is basically a remastered. A remake remastered of the old Duke Nukem game from 1996. Pretty awesome. GameStop's the only place that sells this, which is pretty cool. Uh, it's just an old school um, game that came out back in 96. Remastered, reworked, um, new levels and everything, so it's pretty cool. And I really enjoy the Duke Nukem games of the past. You know, uh, Duke Nukem, Duke Nukem, Planet of the Babes and all that. I can't remember the subtitles of all the games. Uh, a Time to Kill or something. Yeah, stuff like that. They were pretty cool. I couldn't purchase them on my own, so thank God I have family that could do that. But regardless, they were cool games when I was growing up, and this is actually real nostalgic. So GameStop only sells it. It was only 13 bucks. so good deal, good deal. Now, uh, besides that, I have one more thing, or well, two more things. Um, one of my close friends... Uh, she she made a portrait of her children, and they decided to give me a portrait for Christmas. So this is pretty cool right here. It's so I like that. Pretty awesome. Now the last thing I want to show y'all. Now these are pretty awesome. Now, like I said, I've been purchasing stuff for myself all month basically, but I like to say that this is a Christmas gift to myself, even though that's a lot. I've been buying stuff for me all month, like the PlayStation Pro and all. I mean, the PlayStation, yeah, the PlayStation 4, PlayStation 4 Pro and all that. But this is what I got after Christmas, and that is Quiet Comfort 35 Bose headphones. Is it Boost or Bose? I forgot how to pronounce it, but yeah, I bought these for myself right here. These are some amazing headphones. I mean, like for like. 
for me, headphones wise, I just want comfort and basically that's it. Those right there, those are some noise canceling headphones and they're freaking amazing. Um, besides the noise canceling, which is amazing, it feels like you're underwater and you just don't hear nothing. All you hear is the music you have going through. Got wireless Bluetooth. Um, they also have the auxiliary cable so you can hook them up to your PlayStation 4. Um, controller and play games and that I could hook it up to all my handhelds my PS Vita PlayStation portable uh, my Nintendo DS and all that so that's pretty cool and yeah they're freaking hype they're awesome you know they come in this case right here and these are really top-of-the-line expensive headphones it's it costs a pretty penny but I do love them they're amazing so I'm looking forward to playing Resident Evil 7 with these headphones because, you know, it's more at atmospheric, I guess. Uh, I was planning on getting the, v um, the virtual reality, but uh, it's kind of too soon for that. So I'll just go ahead and use the headphones and test that out first. So, yeah, so I got some awesome headphones because, you know, besides playing video games and listening to music and all that, it's pretty cool. Uh, I don't know if any of y'all ever heard of the ASMR uh, ASMR videos where they use it's basically videos where sound is uh, used for satisfaction or pleasurable sounds or something it's hard to explain but that's another cool thing I could use that for because you know those are some awesome headphones and it's it's like a good point of relaxing because music and sound is one of the things that relaxes me a lot listen to some good music and not just sensational sounds basically but yeah those are all my gifts i got for christmas from family friends and to myself so i hope y'all enjoyed that and please comment down below on what gifts y'all got like did y'all get what y'all wanted or you got something you were when you you weren't expecting you know stuff like that and We'll see what else I could bring up in the future before the new year. So, like I said, like this video, share this video, comment down below, and I'll see y'all next time, people. So, take care.